going on? Doug Smith here from uh, you know one of the trainers at Big Tech's gym. Uh, you can also find more stuff from me on BigTechsDrive.com. Uh, so on behalf of BTD today, we're uh, doing a weight workout. Um, actually, this is a post intro video. We actually did it a little bit earlier today. Uh, but anyways, with legs, just want you to know that it's not the way. It is a way. Uh, for me, I like to train as kind of a functional athlete. Uh, right now, I'm doing a little bit of a uh, little bit of powerlifting, a little bit of bodybuilding, and I'm trying to stay lean. I'm trying to keep my body fat under about uh, somewhere around like 16%, and I'm happy with that. Um, so, anyways, hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys learn something, and uh, hope maybe you guys lift some heavy weight with us. All right, let's get to it. So we uh, we just finished our squats right? and uh, you know all of our working sets on here. So now we get to transition into leg press. Yeah, some people say yeah, there's no transition, or there's no transfer of the leg press over to the squat. But I personally don't care uh, because I'm not just a squatter. I like to just build muscle, and I also like to see that I have raw power. I mean, for, so that's really what I do the leg press for. Probably more vanity than anything. However, okay, so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do uh, very similar to how we did, did our uh, squats at like 90%. That's really what the intent is here also, but after, you know, same thing, we'll do kind of a little bit more, more uh, a couple more warm-up sets kind of like over there um, as we transition into it. So even your warm-up sets should hopefully be built with a little bit of muscle. Um, it won't be until after we do this, that'll be our last like heavy, heavy thing that we'll kind of transition into a little bit more just standard. So, the name of the game with this one is just power, you know, and just force through. You know, as we fast forward a little bit to the end of the workout so that you guys didn't see us suffer. Just kidding, it's just short. So hey, what we're doing now, we're just doing a, a quick warm-up for the calves as we transition out. Not that we're cold by any means, but uh, uh, making sure all we're doing is we're doing 10 at a really light weight, getting a good stretch in the bottom for the Achilles, uh, and then trying to get a good peak at the top to try and get as much uh, muscle contraction as we can. Um, what we're about to do is uh, give me some Tabatas. All right? So for those that don't know, uh, Tabata is eight sets. It's 20 seconds of work. 10 seconds of rest. That's one set, and you do eight of those. All right, so I'm about to uh, demonstrate here shortly. One of the reasons I, I like to do that with the calves is because, uh, you know, calves, they do so much work throughout the day, every single time you're moving. So you gotta train calves all kinds of different ways. And there's a million different ways out there to train calves. You gotta do some heavy work, you gotta do some light work, you gotta do some volume. But I tell you what, if you can walk normally after a day of doing a one set of Tabata, uh, Tabata calf raises, uh, you probably did them wrong, or uh, you were bullshit. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat>
Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, remember, you can find more videos on BigTechStrive.com. And uh, as it starts to grow and as it starts to build, we hope to provide you guys more education, more workouts, more supplement advice, uh, everything we can from all of our, uh, you know, all of our trainers here on the staff. Not just at you know here, but uh, everywhere that you know into the uh, the BTD network. Uh, but uh, you know, today we did uh, we did some squats, we did some leg presses, we did some calf raises, uh, we did some uh, leg curls. Uh, normally in that workout, there's also a set of uh, or a couple sets of leg extensions and a couple sets of uh, hip thrusts. But uh, you know, hey, real life happened, and uh, both me and my uh, workout partner got kind of sick and dizzy, and instead call it quits. We're at the point of uh, diminishing returns, you know. So. Uh, but anyways, if uh, you know if you're interested, and if you guys want to uh, know what the rest of it is, just you know shoot me a message, um, and uh, you know, we'll do it. But uh, anyways, hey, hope you enjoyed. Uh, hope you can't walk, and I hope you're sore for about a week. All right, peace out. Check out BigTechDrive.com and uh, train like you mean it.